What's up everybody? Welcome back. Um, check this out. Before we get started in the main part of the video, I wanted to go over some of the names that was given to me for the notch. Uh, I'm going to read them out and if I forgot any, please let me know down in the comments. Um, Cause I think I got all the ones wrote down that everybody suggested. But well, here's the names. The, the Snowflake, Ghost, Technical Notch Out, Arctic Fox. But we already know that somebody already named Arctic Fox and he's too close to me to have two cars in the same area named the same. So that's probably out. Foxation, Golden Child, Stormtrooper, Ghostbusters, White Knight, Milkman, Quarter Horse, Naughty Notch, Project Rusty Butt, Lex, Kind of like Lex though, that, that sounds kind of cool. Lex Luthor, he had green on the Superman episodes and stuff. I like that one. Don Juan, Frosty Fox, Rusty Butt. I think I already said that one, didn't I? Rusty Butt, yeah. Calypso Coop, Greta. And Greta's from the Gremlins, Greta. Kind of like that one, the green, because I want to paint a Calypso. Callie, White Lightning. Those are some of the ones that I got. If I didn't say yours in the comments down below, let me know. I think I got them all, like I was saying. And also, there's another thing I wanna do. My email address is right here. I want you to email me pictures of your car, if you got a Fox body, that is. Cause I wanna start a new thing on here and I wanna display other folks Fox bodies. And what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna see if I can get it to work cause I'm trying to find the right um, software system to do it on. Cause so far, I'm not having any luck with it. But for the time being, uh, if everybody would just email me a picture of their car that they want to have on the show. It doesn't matter if you have a YouTube channel or if you don't have a YouTube channel. If you just have a car and you have an Instagram account or whatever, just send the picture of it to me. Uh, just send a picture of it to me and if I can find the right software to display them, I'm going to do that. Yeah, that's what I'm, I'm going to try to do that and see how that turns out. But uh, now, on with the show. What's up everybody? Welcome back to the Fox Chamber. Uh, this is gonna be episode number five on the Notch Project, or Project Notch, one of them. It's gonna be episode five, and um, what we're gonna do, we're gonna take out the gas tank. And you see I already started dealing with it right there when I was taking off the, the body panels. It was something else I had to take loose to get that out. But anyhow. We're gonna take the gas tank out and see what the damage looks like up under here and see how far we're gonna have to go in cleaning. But you can see there is some surface rust there, a little bit back there. But all in all, it doesn't look too terrible. I guess for a 93, it's about what you expect. And yeah. Isn't that terrible looking? As you know, it's definitely a little grimy. And it does have the uh, 7.5 rear end, which we're gonna eventually change out. It's probably gonna be one of the last things on the list. All in all, it is gonna come out also. But yeah, just getting ready to drop this gas tank and see what it looks like up under there. Because inside the tank doesn't look quite as bad as the bottom does. You can see there again, still a little surface rust. Definitely manageable. Yeah, you can see I already got it up and everything. I didn't feel like taking y'all through all that again. Y'all see me jack that GT up, uh, what, 50, 11 times now? All right, let's get started breaking this thing down and get this tank out of here and see what we got. Still smell, I think it's got, got a little gas in there still. But, that right there is gonna have to be changed out. I don't know if you can see that or not. Now, I'm gonna take out that screw right there, and then one right there, and drop this puppy. So 
Sorry about all the background noise. It's Saturday, people cutting grass, so it's gonna be a little noisy. Hopefully be able to hear what I got to say. And you see I got all the straps and everything down. Now we just gotta lower the gas tank. I got the jack up under it, so when you use that to lower it down safely. Still got the one to get off. I got my trusty tools right here. See if I can get these things off. Find the right one. I think I used them before on the uh, gas lines on the GT. I think. I know I got them mainly for the AC. Push it in there and slide it off. Gotta let those things drain a little bit. But yeah, now you see how I did it. Slide it in there, pop it right off. Put that back up there. And those are also good for um, air conditioner lines and stuff, what I initially bought them for. All right, the gas tank is completely out. All the straps and everything are gone. Uh, I guess that's all the fuel in the lines. Yeah, and they're done draining. That is out. And there's a way to take these off. As you can see, these are not held in there by much rod right here ran through and run inside like that that's basically it and the other side the same way under here don't look that bad I know we looked a little while ago yeah nothing actually up under the uh, gas tank itself that's a good sign I mean, that's that much less that I got to fool with Actually, the gas tank itself don't look too bad. I tried to look in there, but as much as I could. And from what I saw, there wasn't any rust. I'll probably uh, pop these right here off. Matter of fact, I think I'll do that right now. I'll pop those off and see if we can take a look inside and see if there's any rust in there. Because if there's no rust, I'm going to use this gas tank right here. And we need to buy another one when we got a good one. That's uh, relatively decent after we clean it up. Let's look inside. that thing pops right out of there evidently it doesn't let me see if i can figure this thing out right quick yeah it does just pop right out i wasn't prying on it hard enough but yeah see it got it loose yeah from what i can tell it still looks good inside let's take this other one out see what we got All this look like it's in real good shape. Might be able to reuse all of this stuff. I'll replace this, this hose right there though. Maybe. Look like it's in real good shape. All right, let's see if we can get a look inside this tank. Better look. Well, we're waiting. Yeah, from what I can tell, this tank's in good shape. So, all they want to do is just clean this bad boy up. Let me get some of these, uh, some new padding. Stuff like that to go on the outside for dampening purposes. I'm gonna get another one of them because I, my luck, I put that sucker in there and it stopped working. But it was working when I took it out, so I don't know. We'll check it out and see what's going on. All right, I'm gonna say it's gonna be just a short one. So if you like that, hit that like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notifications bell so you can get that fresh stuff when it comes out, and we'll see you later.